Hi guys and welcome to Tech Based. In this video, we're going to talk about the latest Windows 11 Insider preview build for the better channel, which is the build 22635.3646 or version 23H2. I think most of you know that Windows 11 24H2 was released to the release preview channel, so we're expecting the better channel soon enough to get Windows 11 24H2 as well, and maybe some more new features should be tested on the better channel, but we'll see about that. But in this video, we're going to talk about this build because we have a few interesting improvements, and if you enjoy videos like these, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the tech base channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one so let's begin with the video first of all this build adds the pc manager app for devices in china but as i've said in a previous video you can easily install the pc manager app on any pc so you can just go and search for the pc manager app in the microsoft store in the web page of the microsoft store you're gonna get the app you can either download it or open it up using the microsoft store and if you want this you can open it up using the microsoft store and then you can install it so i think it is pretty simple. I'm not sure if there are any limitations or any restrictions, but I have a PC that has the region set to US and I can easily install the Microsoft PC Manager app. So we're also going to open it. When you open it up for the first time, you're going to get this screen. Welcome to Microsoft PC Manager and you have automatically selected start automatically when signed into Windows. I'm just going to uncheck this and then click on start and the Microsoft PC Manager app will start. I'm not going to go in depth with it, but basically this app is an app that helps you optimize your computer, protect your computer, save more storage, see all the apps installed and so on. What is nice about it is that it uses most of the built-in Windows settings and options that you can find in the settings app from Windows 11. In this build, Microsoft also addressed an issue that affects the file explorer. It takes up to two minutes to start when you pin a folder that is on a network shared to quick access. This occurs when you upgrade from Windows 11 version 21H2 to Windows 11 version 22H2. Also related to the file explorer, an issue that made file explorer to stop responding when you swiped from a screen edge. This occurs after you turn off edge swiping. Also, this update addresses an issue that affects a folder context menu. When you choose the command that removes items, the command adds items instead. This occurs when a third-party service implements a sync feature. There are also some improvements related to Bluetooth in this build. This update also addresses an issue that displays a hidden window. Its title bar has no content and no client area. This occurs when you share your screen using certain apps. And also related to known issues, Microsoft is investigating an issue where setting is crashing when trying to look at Wi-Fi properties. In my case, it doesn't crash, but in some cases, it could be crashing so pay attention to that because Microsoft states this is a known issue. So basically this is all there is to it in the new beta channel bill. I made sure to mention all the interesting improvements and fixes but you can find the whole list of fixes and improvements in the article below in the video's description. If you enjoyed this video please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the TechBase channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. I was Emmanuel from TechBase until next time have a nice day.